Hello everyone, I'm Greycloak, thank you for joining me, and welcome back to episode 33 of Factorio with the Space Age expansion, where we just arrived on Folgora in the last episode and are now trying to find out how we can make a new life for ourselves. And one of our big problems is currently power, but I just realized that we are getting ice out of scrap. And with ice we can make water, and with water we can make steam, and with steam we can make power. So, oh, also we get solid fuel out of this. So we should have everything needed to make power, but we need... I guess we can... We can recycle this for copper, if we wanted to use turbines. We can also just use iron for steam engines. And we get iron out of recycling gear wheels currently. But I think it makes sense to recycle some of this. Also, we now started to mine stuff. But yeah, we are just learning and when we figure out new stuff, we can try to replay and all of this. Because we have a lot of mining here and we just want to recycle it all. But first, power. So again, we need the chemical plant to make water. We only want to build in these safe areas though. We do have robots available to bring stuff around. I think we will try to put power down here somewhere. So you make water out of ice. That means you need to request water or ice. Good. This can make how much water? 10, 20 water per second. If we just make these, we don't really get anything out of using steam turbines, do we? Because this only makes 165 degrees Celsius steam and these need 500 degrees. We don't have enough heat from anything, so we need to just make this. I think. And for now, this is just going to go where we can have it. Are we safe here? Yes, we are. Good. Actually, let's turn this around. Because we need to get... Yes, definitely do that. Go away. Oh. We need to get the solid fuel down. So we really need to start to sort all of this, I think. But really, we're at the edge there. Okay. Start by getting this out to the right. Okay. Did I take all of this? I guess I did. that way to connect these without having gaps 
Well, we can just run power down the top and the... Oh, both sides, really. I forgot to look at some of... Wait, did I remove... I removed more stuff that I shouldn't have. Dang it. This is starting to look more and more like we don't want to build here anymore. Because we don't have a lot of safe space. Over here we have a good amount still. Maybe we should move. We could try to make it work. Let's just get the basics working. Eh. Can we please do something? Also, all of this is off center, so move everything two tiles over so we can move this one tile over. So we can get this down in a safe location. Now this is dangerous. Too dangerous. Okay. Move these apart for some power in between. I guess... No, we can't power everything with one. Dang it. Why are we not... Oh, we're not doing any scrap here. Okay. Stop it, you two. You now do normal scrap. Do water. Go water. And then we have power. For a little bit. That did not last long. So I guess 10 or 20 water per second is not enough. 6, 12, 24 we would need here. So not really. But if we could just get a little bit further than. 50% each time. It would be very helpful. And now we run out of solar power again. Hmm. It's always the robopods taking the power. So let's remove this for now. I really just want to go to the other area. It's just sm well, it's not really smaller than this part, and I wouldn't really build up here anyway. It's the area under all of these blue things that is the real area where we can build stuff until we get further. But I also just want to get a little bit up and running. Close this time. Okay, you have to stop, guys. Until we have running power. Is this crap? No. Okay. Order. 
pipe. Collect water. I can't do more than one filter here, right? Nope. Storage. This can go here. Then there's not really any way to get fuel into that though. So we would need ice down here. Water, solid fuel, more water, I think. Okay. Get rid of this for now. And I... No, I didn't just remove one more. Okay, I thought I just did. You are not safe. Okay, power. We have to not let everything down there, though. Build out this to the left. And of course then if we have too much of any of them it will back up so we are messed up in that case. Let me through. Good. So now we have power for a bit. If we mine enough water at least. But we are already running out. Do we really not get enough water? Or is it just because we only have two of these running?
Oh, this is not safe. Okay, what is our next goal here? We want to make Holmium plate. But I would really like to get just a little bit going here. I'm not sure I trust this enough to add robopods again. Especially in this area. Do we just need to go over here? I can't even transfer power between the plateaus. Since it's not secure. At least I guess this will be damaged out here at some point. More green circuits. Can we just sort all of these ourselves? We need again to recycle gear wheels. You are not allowed to be there though. Oh, with enough power, this is actually very fast. Okay. It takes a good amount of power, though. But yeah, then we get iron plate. Are we going to make red belt from the beginning? Send all of it down already. I think we're very close to being able to. Oh, we actually get red circuits from this stuff, of course, so I don't necessarily need to make red circuits. We just don't get green circuits. I think. Yeah. But we could just disassemble some of these, but I think that's not maybe not the greatest idea. Battery. What else are we getting? Potentially we get ice and solid fuel through, but that should then go back around these. So we don't have to store those. Low density structure though. And blue circuits. And iron gear wheels. If we don't take all of them out here. And concrete. And holmium. I think that's everything. Good.
And yeah, this is a problem. We need to store more. And having learned that this is actually not dead yet, but I don't trust it. I think we're going to move over here. We have some amount of mining. Mm. It's just we only have one, two, three, four of these left here after I made mistakes. But maybe I should go and try to clear the other area before I decide to go and f find out that I also remove a lot over there. Let's try and stick to the same chests here. Steal all of it, sure. Batteries, low density, blue, gear, concrete, this. That's outside the safe range. So is that. extra stuff in there so we get more water down to here. I want to bring some of these... no I don't. Let's just go clear a new area where we can try and use what we have learned so far, which is not a lot. Okay, keep away from these, always. So many right here though. I am happy that we brought robots, because otherwise this would be what we did. And that's fast enough, but these larger structures are not that fast. So we are clearing a good amount of the area up top that is secured. I really wish you could take these and move around though, but I am pretty sure that's not possible from my tests so far. Still guessing that if we just get home and we can probably make maybe not these but the 
lightning rods. And they should do the same thing, I would guess. Okay, so just the two down here. Some moving up here. Is that the whole plateau cleared then? I think so. And yeah, now these are just in the way, sort of, but hopefully we can make something that works. We can mine this without problems. We can mine some of this down here as well. Actually, all of it. It's just not a lot. So I need miners. Let's prepare this area from the bottom up, the ground up. So we'll start with mining. What we can, we can make light lightning rods. We learned that from back on Norvis. What? And these protect us in a very funky, fluid way. Okay. Never mind then. Time to get some power, first of all. Yes, please. Then we don't need steam power. I am not that smart when I don't realize what is going on around me. We need more brick. Uh, we had some furnaces at some point, didn't we? But we threw them away or what? No, I used them for boilers, of course. Okay. Just give me some of those, please. You filter stone and no salt fuel. You can actually walk between these. That seems like sort of an oversight, because usually when buildings are that close together, they don't want you to walk, walk between them. But oh well, um, it makes makes life easier for me, so why would I complain? Infinite of these now. Then we need a lot of storage for power though, still. Can we produce that? We get batteries, so we should be able to produce it. As long as we make iron, and we are making iron, good. want to secure the whole area or are we putting these into our builds and only expanding 
I just want to sort of do this right now, honestly. Just because. This can go away now. And we don't care about removing these anymore, do we? They're larger and... Range 20 plus 10. These 15 plus 10. Okay, so these actually have a larger area. But these we can fit in wherever we want, so go away. And go away with this. Good. How fast is this? Not very fast when we don't have robots to supply it with stuff. I want more of that. This is going to be removed soon, and then we will make a accumulator farm up here, I think. I obviously need this in that farm. Let's be a little bit more non-chaotic about this. If we do this, we could sort of tessellate these like this. But what if we needed this as well? It would be a mess. Unless we overlap like that. But we lose space. We need to maybe just add these. Does this work out? I don't know. Give me more. This is pretty okay. Except that the power poles don't reach these, which is the one thing they really need to hit. Uh, more, more, more scrap in. Okay. 
please finish. But yeah, these just don't hit. We can't do this exact build, but I do want to just finish it, please. More resources, please. I am running out of power poles. Luckily, those are pretty easy to make. With the resources we have here. Okay. I want to be able to move in these, but I can't. So this doesn't help at all. We need a different design, okay. Though I like the idea of this. God dang it. I don't want to run out of resources all the time, please. When I'm just trying to learn how to build stuff. That is a build. This is pretty good, I think. Just don't need these too, too often. Go. Sure. Let's go make a accumulator farm thing bank. Where did I get all of these from? If not from here. Oh, are we just getting it from the ruins, maybe? Could make more of those, but let's not. For now, more accumulators. So we don't have to worry about power for too long. Yeah, okay, so they do die. Okay, build up here. do want to also just utilize the space at the end here. Though no, that's an annoying int to this build. Hmm. 
Let's give ourselves a little bit more time to have fun here with making this build nice. So this ends around here, that's fine. It does extend all the way to there. So clean ending, two power poles. Clean ending, two power poles, yes. Oh well, how about we just do that? And then maybe don't put them here. I need to go out, please. Thank you. Okay. Then we should have power. Actually, having more of these is a good thing, because we should get more power, right? Or is there just a limited number of lightning strikes every night? Or within a given area? Do we have to actually have large areas covered with these? Maybe. For now though, I'm going to ignore it and think that we just have enough. Which means we can now remove this and reclaim some space. Want to just remove it all, honestly. But I think we have too much in storage at this point. But then that's fine. Just do it. If we have some resources in the middle and then build robot stuff on both sides. But we need to get more resources in and they need to be filtered. stop. Can't get extra resources in here very nicely. Do we just mine this and let robots bring it to machines? That seems weird. These can mine how much? Also, let's not get them killed. Mining speed 0 0.5. Mining time 50%. What does that mean though? Is that just the same number basically? Oh yeah, we're not connected anymore. Mm. Don't want to be connected right now though, but maybe we should be. Good enough. It is just 0.1 per second plus productivity, right? Why does that seem like a lot more? 
1.7 per second. Is that because it's 0 0.5 mining speed per second mining speed divided by 0 0.5 mining time? So that's 1 plus 70%. Yeah, that's 1.7. Okay. So the 50% there and the mining speed here is not the same thing. Good. Oh well. Something. Just something to know. These can use up scrap how fast. Takes 0 0.2 seconds. So five times per second with a crafting speed of 0 0.5 is 2.5 per second. So two minus is enough to supply one of these and then some. I'm just wondering if you could do something like this. I mean, you could, yes, but would it make any sense? Not really. As well, this is not very tileable, is it? I could just put them both on one side of this instead. So we get 3.4 for 2, which is more than we can use here. 6.8 It's not exactly the 7.5 we would need for 3, but maybe Or maybe we just fill builds and then do this afterwards How much are we getting out of this? Because I don't think we get 2.5 items out A lot of the time we just don't get anything I would think I think it's about one item per second. So you would want to have two builds of input for one build of output. And this is quite a wide setup. Then again, if we had two of these. Isn't that about the same width as this? It's actually wider. Okay. Again, we need to start with mining and then figure out what we're doing afterwards. But I need a bunch of miners for that, of course. But then we did make a lot of green circuits, so that's good. And we remove all of our resources out here for now. Eh, I don't want my machines out there, though. My stuff goes in here. Not my robots, though. This is just junk, though, at this point, but it will. Oh, I'm crafting. That's what's getting in here. Okay. Uh, fine. I think so. Good. Not my robots. Oh, well, robots go in there as well.
really should order this sorted. Also, we should really get some protection here. Why didn't I sort when I didn't have all my inventory on me? I don't know. Okay, stone. Gear wheels. Gear. Steel. Nothing else. Weird stuff in there. Brick. Concrete. Water. Iron. And then that's okay for now. Okay. Let's actually try to build something here. Yes, I will pull this power back just in a second anyway, because we need power for the mining, but still. Go away with this? Sure. I could dedicate whole, this whole area to smelt off. Oh, recycling, actually. But we'll see. I have a blueprint for mining. Why don't I utilize that? And then I'm going to realize soon that I I'm going to need a lot more build for this. Belt. We can. Okay. We are setting up bootstrap again, I guess. Out of the way of the other stuff. Go. It would have made sense if I had just made it right here. Why didn't I do that? Okay. Good. We have everything available. You make belt. You make red belt, because I want red belt. Anything else we need right now? I can craft miners. If I know what they take. Iron, of course. We need iron for the belt as well, though. So we can't use too much iron before we are ready to make more iron, surprisingly. Mm. If these make 1.7 per second, what does 18 of them make? Does it matter? Probably not. Just need it to work. But I'm going to be annoyed by it not being good at some point. Or good ratios. Just build it. I guess we're just going to mine all of it and then balance it and then put it into recyclers. Right? I think so. More, minus, low iron gear wheels.
more iron, and that's the problem. Okay, no more miners after this. Start with these. Just imagine that we're also mining up here. Or maybe we just put ghosts down for it. Just want all of this mind, really. Though most of this really doesn't need a red belt, but for now, let's see if we can just make it work. That's not more than a belt, right? I don't think so. Okay. Mm. We're not mining everything here now. Ow. Okay. Defend that. That is just about everything mined that we need to mine here. Right? Yes. Then we balance it. And we're going to collect it all up here somewhere. Sure. And this will make the last belt. I need more stone brick. I do not need to make wire out of cover right now. Wire is almost free. And there's all the belt gone. But we have more. Good. Okay, so we have a bunch here that has been mined. Then we want to process it, recycle it. And we want two builds to become one. I just don't want too much out here without lightning rods. So, something like this. Power, power. And we need to get connected to the main power now. Good. Good. 
Okay. If we want more of these, we need more steel and concrete. And gear wheels, and then probably blue circuits, but no. We had plenty. We don't have a lot of gear wheels left, okay. But hey, if we just empty these out, we have a lot more stuff. So, calculator. We have 90 items per second here. Divided by 2.5 items consumed per second, we need 36 of these. 8, 16, 32. Did I say 36? Eh, no history. 36. So, something like that. As long as the belts are full. And while we only have this setup, I'm pretty sure we have two full belts. Just not when we... if we want to duplicate this. And then we have a bunch of items coming out of here that we need to sort. How are we going to sort that? Like we did before, just put it into chests and have a roundabout build or something. Is that the best I can do? So where do we want to build everything? We have a lot of space actually. As long as I don't get annoyed with everything being in the way. These don't have to be connected to power to protect, right? I can just do whatever. I think so. Another build like this would be coming out here. At which point we would have more than a belt, but I'm just going to mark that and then maybe figure it out later. Belt. Input priority left, so it always runs and gets past the chests that it needs to get past. Why didn't I save the filters from earlier? I don't know. We get concrete. We get Stone. We get steel, iron gear wheels, copper cable, red circuits, blue circuits, ice, solid fuel. Batteries and Holmium. Maybe more that I'm forgetting. Good.
Yes, I'm forgetting low density. But otherwise, I think we're fine. What does it look like when you have a belt going across a hole like that? It just is a flat plane. Okay. That is a little bit weird, but I can live with that. We need bulk inserters here, it feels like. Can we make bulk? Yes, for now at least we can. Okay. That's a lot of resources coming in. Good. Then... Robots. Again. And stop using this. Go to the other RoboPod. Oh, it's not powered. Okay. Go in there. Start down here. We need some of these to also be part of this robot network though. Maybe we should do those first, or maybe we should do those on this side. Maybe a lot of stuff. I could just route it back into the belt, but I don't think I want that. Hmm. It was something like that. Request. Provide. Inserter. And power. Potentially. Then we can request uh, gear wheels to be made into iron plate and we can request cable to made into cover and stuff like that. Good. Can we make some more recyclers? We can pretty easily. Stay away from those please, but get close enough to this to be able to limit it so we can scale it. Good. Okay, to here, request iron gear wheels. To here, request cover cable. As long as we don't have to make too much of it, it's fine. We could, of course, just have connected it directly. Isn't this a waste of robot uh, strength, basically, whatever. If we do this, on the other hand, we are better. No, wait, what? You have to have a filter then. Iron gear, you filter, cover cable. Uh, 
Okay. I see that I've used too many resources to set all of this up that we're not using. Uh, stop yourselves, please. Please stop taking my things. Thank you. Okay, time to make simple things. Steel chest is simple. As if provider would be simple if we had green uh, circuits, but it's needed. sort of want to keep resource production on this side but I also want to reserve this space for later so just from here and up we can do this so let's not do this over here but on this side It seems like we're using too much of our cable here. So maybe just connect these to the logistic network and only allow it to work if we have enough. Uh, cover cable is above. 200 Good That's some of the basic things we need Yep We do not have enough accumulators anymore so time to start producing those again. But we require more green circuits for that. Don't I have some? I have a few, I guess. Wait, not... We don't need green circuits for that, never mind. Just make sure we have some of this. Okay, build stuff. Good. Oh, I am carrying a lot of accumulators on me. We should utilize those. None of this should be in danger, right? Correct. Then we can take that whole thing. But we don't have any more accumulators already. Okay. But let's plan this out anyway. Accumulators and miners. Good. I guess we are a little bit wasteful with our power with robots and stuff, but... For now, it's a lot easier to work like this.
And we are making a lot of accumulators. Okay, let's just make it a little bit faster though. We're out of steel. In there at least. For steel chests, maybe. It's fine though. We make more. And we are ready to just put more of these down again, I guess. As long as we have the power. They are quite power hungry. We are dropping in charge though. Can we please have a thunderstorm again? No gear wheels. Okay. No iron left either. We use it all for green circus and belt, I guess. That makes sense. Can we take this, this out, though, please? It's not all of the gear wheels we're using, though. We are charging up pretty dang fast. Okay, so we have enough lightning rods at least. Good to know. Just need way more accumulators. Okay. But unfortunately, that's all we have time for in this episode. So thank you all for joining me, and I'll see you next time. Bye.